Welcome everyone! Hello. We are the Grin Brothers and I... we've entered the incredibly dangerous, somehow less Death foggy. Forest. Yeah, somehow less foggy than either an N64 game or Subnautica. Uh, Wait, Lou, where do you think it got off to? I don't know, Hop, it's a straight path. <laughs> Hop jumps over onto the onto the sort of ledges there. Hop, what are you doing? You defy the natural order! <laughs> I am a god. <laughs> the fog is coming in with thick. Like London! <laughs> I heard about the fog, but this is ridiculous! <laughs> if we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble! After I've... all, none of us right. have defog in this region! I'm gonna say something now, which I probably should have said in like the first two episodes. Uh... Oh gosh, it's a Scovert, we're dead! <laughs> the most <laughs> fierce creature! This is a dangerous sort of Pokemon that we have to be careful about! Should I just run? Fight or run, your choice. I mean, it, uh, it might be easier to catch Pokemon if we're not over -leveled. Yeah, that's my thought. And so. to be fair, you get to a point where... But I've, around 5th gym, you end up basically plateauing, yeah. and nothing catches up with you, really. Doing right there, so oh, let's be sure you're in tip-top shape! For that single fight against the level 2 Squirrel. Um, yeah, so, a lot of the jokes I've made so far have been sensitive in nature. <laughs> Somewhat inappropriate. Yeah. And I mean, okay, there's an old one you can add. You, you need to name the Pokemon after what would happen if Jim Pond had a stroke. Well. So, which is also rather a bit of a sensitive nature. And I want to preface that, like, in of themselves, this stuff isn't funny. I do not support... Any of them. We are not Leon. Um, but Leon is a terrible person. <laughs> yet people seem to really, really like Leon. And I don't know why. They like his body. And I find great satisfaction in taking a character and just making them the worst person ever. If it's... that's the worst person, and more that we're just revealing the light on him. Yeah. Oh god, another squirrel, we're dead! <laughs> it's... It's like the joke it's gonna game poop berries made, at us. where it's like that is the quickest way to take a perfectly lovable character and completely ruin them by making them a <laughs> <laughs> Um But like, yeah, obviously, um, abuse. Uh, Come on, Ela, that Wooloo might be in real trouble. I'm not gonna ban it like others have abandoned me. <laughs> um, abuse, assault. Molesting Neglect. people, adult and child, uh, misogyny, um, <laughs> and I'm sure we'll find more things to make Leon a terrible person. None of those are good things. There are, there, I've got more, don't worry. It's, um, I'm saved up for a very special scene which highlights everything wrong with Leon. But... This is mad. Can't even see me own hand in front of my face. How are we supposed to get out? We're just going to die here, yeah? Yeah. We're I, dead. Yeah. I think I get now why this place is off limits, because it's foggy. I think I just I, tripped I on think, a skeleton. I don't, I don't think the fog's the scariest part. I mean, after all, how would people go about London? Yeah, I know, the fog is ridiculous there. Have you seen the rest of my ear? <laughs> Wonder. Yes. Please give me clothes, I'm naked. Please, I know what Pokemon yes. fans are like. I need clothes. <laughs> Bondulance. Oh. God, he looks terrible about the rest. Go on, mess him up before he yiffs us. So you just spray your liquids at him? Yes, I pee on him. <laughs> <laughs> you can't yiff me if I urinate on you first. What? The move had no effect on it. We need to yiff against him harder. Sorry, what was that? I'm missing half an ear! You'll have to speak louder! Yes! <laughs> Ela, I can't see anything! You okay? No, he just filled the air with chloroform, which is basically what he does. Mm. God knows what he does whilst we're unconscious, and I'm not going to think about Somehow, it. Somehow, probably not anything worse than what Leon would do. Well, it's true. I mean, he can't do anything, because he's not real. He's a bunch of mist. They never explain this, do they? No. I can't see anything! Like, he can't believe this is how we're gonna die! <laughs> he's technically dead. At the discount spoilers, I get no one cares. The, the, both the legendary dogs are, like, buried. 
Like they vanished and died. What kind was of even like the that. point? Like again, I thought for a second with my sudden short start because I've done a sudden short start link in the summary below. Um, I thought that uh, they were actually going to have Hop taken by the dogs or eaten. Or, you know, it's like, oh my gosh, that's a twist I never thought some coming. Are you telling me the rival has been kidnapped? Ela and that other person that stands next to you. Ela, not Ela. <laughs> what? Hey? Me? How do you how do you manage to find your way here? Your pants of directions. Divine intervention. I just burnt down the forest till I found a clearing. Also got to reveal a, a baby's gender. Who would have thought? <laughs> <laughs> uh, D now all of Gala knows that it's a boy. Now all of Gala knows that you're a boy. Really? He, no, no one knows you. I've been waiting ages for either, and I figured you must have dragged her off somewhere. Because you're a terrible person for me to be around. You're not taking her from me, Top. Of course I came looking for Ela and you to punish you. I'm going to beat you up now. Like I did to the professor's granddaughter. She hadn't made me a sandwich. Instead she went off into the woods. It's, wait. Apparently she was trying to, I don't know, flee from their existence, but... Where's the... Wo she had a noose, so I used it to beat her. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Dead Hop! You failed! <laughs> Charizard killed it! Meh, nah, please, I have been scarred for life. Just, just, end just, me. Pl just play dead. You'll get out fine. <laughs> play dead! <laughs> the old view had fainted by the time I found you. Don't um, worry, I gave you CPR. Wait, no, that's literally not what happened. We had woken mm. up by the time he got here. He can't even remember get the story. That's the story I'll tell people. You had all fainted, but we were awake by then. And I saved you from the mist. Just me. I deal to be in mist. As a concept. <laughs> <laughs> and you know that they'll believe me because I'm in power and can control the media. I can do and say whatever I want. <laughs> Everything bends to my will because I am Will. You're Come Leon. On. That's my middle name, Leon Will. I know I'm laughing, but it is uncomfortably real, and it does make me incredibly sad. You did good, either. And at least that wound is all right. Yeah, Ela? We could have died <laughs> if Leon had come here earlier and actually found us unconscious. I dread to think of what would have happened to me. And all because you thought, and all because you innocently thought that no actually works. <laughs> all because I have you are actually a genuine good person, Hop. How dare you? <laughs> I thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in, that mad Pokemon attacked us. We we're gonna I'm be glad yet I have for a Pokemon, sure. Because I know that no won't work on Leon. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Attacked by some mad Pokemon. Damn, that the... could have been a good opportunity. What are you talking about? Clearly you're delusional, just like the fact that you think we're related. It seems loads of strong Pokemon. Uh, it seems loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. Thank you. And it just had this sort of presence. Like being dead. I mean, it was like, oh, oh. <laughs> Why am I still here? Who summoned me to this plane of existence? I was happy being dead! <laughs> I mean, really, they seem to pass right through it. Shut up! Your moves pass right through it? That's how weak you are. <laughs> Your attacks are so weak, the Pokemon can't... They face for reality itself? <laughs> Fierce and Pokemon... I'm sure that your strength, uh, your, your weakness just brought Ela down, that's why her attacks didn't work. Fierce and Pokemon, they say lives in the slumbering world. How do you actually pronounce it? Normally, I'd well? feel happy about being praised so much, but it feels uncomfortable coming from you. I make everyone feel uncomfortable. <laughs> but they're not legally allowed to say it because they get arrested. I have a secret police for that. Get strong enough, and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. <laughs> I feel like um, we could have really done with a Rotom fan. <laughs> Just. <laughs> Legendary dog defeated. It's oh gone. no, I'm just thinking of the comic, of the awkward zombie comic. All oh, right, my first Pokemon. But what about Rotom? Rotom's not a Pokemon. <laughs> you got Rotom. I've oh, Rotom in the phone. For now, let's get out of here. You'll be all right now that I'm here with you. 
I feel less safe. Thank God we have a body cam. Even if we did get an from Lee... That's not the only thing that's going to be full. What an experience! This will be a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. I was knocked unconscious by a field of chloroform <laughs> by a ghost dog. A, a dog came, drugged me, and I was left unconscious on the floor. Um, don't forget to t tell your mother. Yeah, we didn't tell her we were going into Death Forest. She'll go spare if you leave without a word, even worse than Lee just did. Like when he actually went... showed concern for me. That that wasn't concern, Hop. I'm, gl I'm glad you seem to think that. He didn't show wasn't... concern for you. <laughs> he didn't care. He just wanted to hurry I up. I got an April. It was the happiness that of my, my life. <laughs> Someone spoke enough. to me. <laughs> what? I would speak to you too, Hop, if I wasn't a mute. Oh, your sub was a sweetheart. He's always constantly lonely. Even with other people, he's always alone. Also, the implication of calling it Bondulance implies it's having a stroke 24-7. <laughs> Here's our subble. <laughs> he's always lonely and always having a stroke. And suffers from constant strokes. I just want to die! <laughs> we tried to kill... Uh, we tried to put him out of his misery, but his body's too sturdy. I feel so much sadness for my Pokemon. I'm going to play the game one day. <laughs> Give us Pokeballs. Here we are, a bit of pocket money. It's like 50 grand. It's like ridiculous. Maybe some potions. Are we going to use items in battle? Try not to. Yeah. Sobble will fight. But honestly, till... we've taken so long that I don't feel like repeating too much. Sobble will fight till the very end for you. It will die to protect you. <laughs> and I. I, 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 I sh <laughs> What did you do? <laughs> Come home and rest, yaddy yaddy. Okay. Just, you just got yeah. Elo wheel, you know, taking a sub around in the little wheelchair. I mean, that would look kind of adorable, I won't lie. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a wheelchair. Oh, I forgot the Pokemon. It's the wheelchair kid from South Park. Yeah. <laughs> right, well. <laughs> did, we didn't get given Pokemon save. Oh, Sobble is gonna suck. <laughs> it's a start. At of least it's got not got negative. It's a start of a usual Pokemon journey for me. I mean, my Grookey had decreased attack. I think the. Oh yeah, we did get some Pokeballs, so I can go catch a skull. Increased special defense, the... aka Grookey's worst stat. No, it was the in decreased defense, increased. Special. The, the advantage is it doesn't affect any of its good stats. Yeah. Guess. Guess I'll probably train up Score Bunny a bit by having it battle against Pokemon to grass. I'm sure that ain't going to be a problem with a Pokemon who sets things on fire by its feet. Um, no offense, Hop, but you should probably level up Wooloo first, given it's the lower level. Get yourself to that building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball. It's a Doesn't Pokeball. Doesn't barely hop. even looks Reddit from this distance. It's a Pokeball, Hop. We we know what Pokeballs are. That's the research Pokemon lab. Research Lab. One of them. There's two of it's them. It's also apparently a sandwich shop, according to my brother. But it's strange, because I don't see it selling sandwiches. Also, those hot Wooloos just spawned from the ground. Yeah. Do they, I yeah. thought that applying cotton in the... Uh, I thought... <laughs> I thought... I didn't think that applying wool into the ground would actually make them grow. But it did. Um, Nickets. We, uh, oh, we do have a Pokeball. Yes. Squirrel! Should we just go for the first one? Might as well. You encountered a wild Scovet. 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 I don't know how to pronounce it. Given its name, this is pretty ironic. Pound! Was it surprising I level level 6? At least uh, we don't have to worry about leveling up. Oh yeah, I forgot it's got like a ton of defense. Might as well hit it with Wargun. Yeah, hopefully it won't die. Because it does not have so much special defense. Though I guess, to be fair, in the younger stages, the stats aren't so much a deal, are yeah. they? And at this rate, we're going to end up killed. Wouldn't that be funny, though? <laughs> they tend to be easy enough to catch, so yeah, throw a Pokeball. Given your plan for the name, this is pretty ironic that it's a female one. I mean, to be fair, it is a, like, neutral name. Mm. 
Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. Thank you for the. I, I'm used to playing Nexamon, a much better game that I forgot that <laughs> this <laughs> that doesn't have any Leons in it. That I forgot <laughs> that you level up via catching Pokemon. I almost forgot how so, to spell Jesse. There's an I in it. No. There no I in his one. No. Okay. I, know, I thought it was going to be the whole name. No, just Jesse. Oh, I thought it was going to be the yeah, actual. But apparently, this Pokemon's being named after. Jesse Cox. Super Jesse Cox. I because one of be... the first comments with um, its evolution that most a lot of people thought was it looks like Jesse Cox, <laughs> including Jesse Cox himself. Made even better by the fact that its shiny sprite is pink, <laughs> uh, which is a very Jesse color. Mm. Uh, also, it is a glowing Wooloo. Wait, what? really? Yeah. So we got a shiny Wooloo in it's this. It's not shiny. Oh. Glowing. Okay. Our Squiver is... Oh, thank God. Okay, increased defense, decreased special attack. That is perfect. And it's got a good ability as well. Yeah, cheek pouch. Tackle tail whip bar. And we basically don't need to level it up. We, we... Thoroughly cunning, which I... And it's impish by nature. I assume cunning raises the special gain. Which is pointless. <clears throat> well, that was fun. We're almost dead, so I guess we go back to a Pokemon Center. Well, it's right up ahead. Oh, yeah. Oh, thank gosh. <laughs> I don't understand why they did both ways. Oh, Where'd that Charizard come from? That's Leon's Charizard. Where's Leon? He's had a moment of peace. Oh, oh. <laughs> finally escaped. The Pokestan is up at top. Up top. Are we allowed to go this way? Yes, yeah. we are. Can we... Just... Oh, wait, no. Because there's a guy nope. with really in the way. My Wooloo simply loves the Pokemon Center! Yeah, they give me drugs! <laughs> <laughs> hey, maybe we can find We've turned Galar into <laughs> just a cesspit! Can I just. Well, it's based, yep. off, it's based off England, so it's not that much of a stretch. That rather grand building behind it. But, but... Beside us is the Pokemon Research Land. Though if it's Professor Magnoli you're seeking, you'll find her at home down the far end of Route 2. She's the Professor that. Actually has the title of professor. She doesn't like to consult with us common folk. <laughs> she is above us. Right. She says the only one who can talk down Why to her is Leon. Why you stood there ominously, Leon? Are you here to beat Sonya again? I got some alone time away from Charizard so that he won't get jealous. <laughs> Charizard. <laughs> I'm here to protect this child because <laughs> I've only got so much dignity left. <laughs> yeah. Also, um, Charizard's got... meant to be like... Um, Charizard is uncomfortably short. Well, yeah. Well, at like, most he's well. Actually, no, he's really weird here because he's six foot. Yeah. Well. Well, Jay Witz is taller than him, and Jay Witz is six foot. Yeah, I'm taller than Charizard. Yeah, as you're well, taller than Charizard. Well done. You've reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon. Reason. How little do you? You think managed to about? find the sandwich shop. <laughs> you managed to find it. Impressive there? for it a woman. Like a ball, but actually, it's a sandwich. <laughs> I didn't think a woman would make it this far. I'm hopeless when I'm not being given God-given orders. I'm hopeless with place. directions. I'm not actually. It's just something to make me feel more human. It lets people let their guard down and think I'm like them. See, ha. see how your world has already grown? Yeah, I walked from... You walked to the next town. The... I bet you've never been far outside the kitchen before. Which... <laughs> Leon, I've I've already been to this town. Where do you think we get groceries from, Leon? And I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me. In bed. He keeps me company at all times. I've seen things. <laughs> there is no part of my body that doesn't soar. Now in we go. <laughs> oh, please, leave oh. the woman alone. She doesn't deserve this. No one else does. Why, my woman, body. where's my sandwich? We've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. For a woman, she's got pretty good sense. <laughs> oh, uh, she's made all these colourful paper things on the walls. <laughs> you mean books? <laughs> what? What's a book? Ah, uh, filthy Gala Pokemon. I like Charizard. <laughs> I, I wonder if I could take this into bed as well. What is it today, Leon? Please, I thought I had a restraining order against you. Uh, you here? Uh, 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 please tell me you're here for info on Pokemon. Nah, a sandwich! 
Stop with these outlandish requests. I don't just make sandwiches. I right. have a respectable job. So I know it's a bit late into the episode, but we'll keep through this cut soon. Just so we can explain why Leon's a misogynist. Um, <laughs> Good to see you too, Yampa. I remember the days when... Uh, when Yamp you... here is the real champ when it comes to helping around. Yeah. Sonia's kind of worthless outside yeah. the kitchen. I remember its father, a bolt on that Sonia used to have back when she thought she could be a Pokemon trainer. I, I killed it! I murdered it! Women you... shouldn't be training! You came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day. Not when I get lost, because I don't get lost. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, and this is Sonya. And that's Sonya. What can I say? Well, I like I her like cooking. She cooks. That's it. That's it. She makes food you can gobble down in a flash, now, as a woman should. And what kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? Yeah, so... You are a, you are a woman. You couldn't be a rival. That's why I found Raihan. It wasn't just Yamba helping you out. I did too. Yeah, but Yamba's a man, unlike you. Um, so, yeah, here's the thing. Uh, I know it's meant as a joke, but Leon gives absolutely no credit to Sonya, really. And A lot of people don't. Yeah, no no one gives credit. Sonya is in the same situation as Hop. They are two of the best characters in this game because they are so mistreated. Um, also, I kind of forgot that she actually had a green jumper on after an artwork from Brylux Lexanov I saw, so... Yeah. A lot of people forget that. She, I mean, people forget that she's not got giant tits. Mm. Like she's. I mean, that's most of the characters in Pokemon. Well, yeah. Like the children. <laughs> this is Ela. I'm gonna try and kidnap her. She's a new Pokemon trainer, but you can set her on the right path where she'll cook, make sandwiches, right? I wish Yampa would run up and just bite him in the. <laughs> nah, I thought he was gonna lift his leg up. Pee on him. What does he think I am? I just want to be respected by someone in this world. He's always got his head in his misogynistic clouds. And every <laughs> other aspect. No wonder he gets lost all the time. <laughs> or at least says he does. Really, it's bad. It's more a case of me hiding from him. Hey there, Rotom. You respect you, you me. You acknowledge they exist! <laughs> oh, God! Rotom phones are handy little things, right? They managed to make me up, uh, keep me up to date where Leon is so I can avoid him. Unfortunately... I, I've been kept safe thanks to him. <laughs> yeah, um... Yeah, Leon's kind of misogynistic. Um, I know it's intended as a joke, but, like... The way that the pretty much the main person he doesn't give respect to is his younger brother and Sonya. And no one seems to give respect to Sonya. It or Hop. Just like really doesn't help me like Leon. Um, also, we'll just end here because yes. this cutscene will go on too long. But yeah, there you go. That's why we turned Leon into a misogynist because he's a terrible person. Really, it's not even we've turned him into anything. We've just in heart, you know, we've just pointed exaggerated. Out, pointed some out of the his things feature. that are a part of him. Admittedly, the children thing probably not quite. Well, actually, no. To be fair, he has an ob obsession with your character, so oh, yeah. and an ob obsession with Charizard. Actually, we haven't changed anything about him. We've even, just exaggerated. Even the other flaw to Leo get point out is true. Yeah. But that's a flaw that doesn't get pointed out until miles yeah, so later. So we'll get to that. So. Yeah. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe for us to ruin the characters that you love. <laughs> Cheerio, everyone! We'll progress with this game at some point. <laughs>